Hello everyone. It's a pleasure to be joining you all today at this year's virtual 2020 Trends Festival. Today I'm going to talk about how we can build a net zero future. My message to all of you today is an open invitation to join us, build a net zero world. Because it's within our reach and if we all work together, we can make it happen. Our industry plays an essential role in society. It addresses basic human needs like shelter and safety. It enables social progress with infrastructure connecting people from schools to roads, hospitals, metros or bridges. It gives shape to people's aspirations with architectural landmarks from the Colosseum in Rome to Singapore's Marina Bay Sands. That's why I like to say the future isn't written, it's built. Before I tell you more about this, let me share some fast facts about Lafarge Holcim. We are the world's global leader in building materials and solutions with a turnover of 27 billion Swiss francs. We are operating 2,300 production sites in 75 countries and uh, we have a team of over 72,000 people worldwide. We are leading the way in sustainable construction as the number one ranking company in ESG by Sustainalytics in our sector. We are becoming a net zero company partnering with the Science-Based Targets Initiative. And we are at the forefront of driving green construction with one third of our sales in this area already today. And this is just the beginning. We have the biggest research and development organization in our industry with our global R&D center in France and five regional centers supporting all our markets with 50% of our research and development dedicated to green construction and over 40% of our patents in this area. Here are some facts that people sometimes don't realize. Concrete is the second most used material in the world after water. With the world's population estimated to grow to 9 billion by 2050 and 2 billion more people expected to live in cities, 60% of the built environment is not yet built. This represents the equivalent of building New York City every single month for the next 20 years. 1.6 billion people lack adequate housing today when the right to shelter should be a basic human right. With our growth strategy uh, driven by reinventing how the world builds to shape, a world that is greener, leading the way in green construction with carbon neutral and circular building solutions. A world that is smarter, driving the next frontier of technology, shaping innovative and digital solutions to make a bigger impact. A world that works for everyone, advancing social progress with essential infrastructure, affordable housing and thriving with our communities. Let me give you some examples of what I mean. For instance, we offer the world's broadest range of green concrete, EcoPact, making carbon neutral construction a reality. EcoPact offers a variety of low carbon profiles with a reduction of 30 to up to 100% less carbon footprint compared to standard concrete. EcoPact is a critical building block to shape a net zero future. We are also driving circular construction to build a zero waste future. Circular construction means that nothing gets lost and everything gets reused, recycled or reduced. Today we are one of the world's leading global recycling companies with 50 million tons of materials recycled across our business. On our net zero journey, we are doubling our ambition to become a 100 million tons per year recycling company. An example of this is how we recycle construction and demolition waste into new green building products. For instance, our circular cement Susteno has 20% recycled concrete inside. Shaping a smarter world, we are advancing innovation and digitalization to have a bigger impact and do more with less. For instance, using 3D printing, 
we enable the construction of higher windmills that can harness stronger winds, generating 25% more renewable electricity at lower cost. With this technology, we can accelerate the transition to a renewable economy. Another example is our transport analytics center using AI and datafication to optimize our logistics. This is a critical competitiveness driver for us, as concrete is more perishable than yogurt. Fresh concrete typically starts hardening within two hours, so speed of delivery is of essence. At every given moment around the world, we have hundreds of thousands of trucks, trains and boats delivering our concrete to construction sites. By optimizing our logistics, we are increasing the speed and efficiency of our delivery, reducing waste and optimizing our CO2 footprint. Shaping a world that works for everyone, we want to improve quality of life for the many and not just the few. Making housing accessible to all, we use local materials around the world to build affordable and greener housing. We also started deploying 3D printing to build affordable housing and schools from Malawi to Iraq. Wherever we operate, we are committed to thriving with our communities. We have invested over 240 million Swiss francs in community projects in the last five years, from education to healthcare, uplifting the livelihoods of close to 30 million people. We focus our work in the most critical areas where we can make the biggest difference for our communities, such as making education and healthcare services accessible to as many people as possible. During these COVID times, this is a key priority for us across all our markets. So far, we have touched the lives of over 4 million people, from building emergency field hospitals to providing essential goods and protective equipment, all the way to sanitizing public spaces. Our journey to reinvent how the world's built started a while back for us. Today, we are accelerating our focus by becoming a net zero company. We created our foundation for sustainable construction 17 years ago in 2003 to engage and inspire architects, engineers, academics and policymakers to lead the next frontier of sustainable construction. Putting sustainability at the heart of the company's strategy and decision making, I appointed our first Chief Sustainable Officer last year as a member of the Executive Committee. Together with the EXCO, we set our net zero ambition. To walk the talk on our commitment, I put in place performance incentives for the company's top 200 leaders to deliver on our sustainability objectives, starting with CO2 reduction. Our research and development center in Lyon is the largest of our industry. It dedicates over 50% of its resources to green construction. We are becoming a net zero company, taking a rigorous science-driven approach by partnering with the Science-Based Target Initiative. And the Science-Based Target Initiative has verified our 2030 targets, and we are working together to define our net zero roadmap beyond 2030. It's exciting to be entering uncharted territory together to shape the first net zero roadmap in our sector. I'm excited to see how we are accelerating our impact this year as we are rated number one in the construction sector in Sustainalytics ESG ratings. Green concrete is the material of choice for building a net zero future based on all its benefits from being locally sourced safe, durable, versatile, affordable, and enabling great aesthetics, comfort, and energy efficiency. You can count on me to keep on pushing the boundaries of green construction across everything we do. A net zero future is within our reach. What's holding us back today is mainly market demand and having the right policies and incentives in place to make it mainstream. I invite you all, the next time you're part of building a new home, 
school hospital or even a windmill, make sure it's built green. Ask for your concrete's carbon footprint and challenge yourself to make it carbon neutral and circular. That's how we can build a net zero future together. The more you demand green building materials in your world, the faster we can get there. Join us to accelerate the transition to a net zero world because the future isn't written, it is built. Let's build it net zero together.